What's happening, everyone? It's DV, and we are back in Slap Battles for a new badge glove. It's the Pan Glove, and you need to own Into the Crypt badge. This is what the badge looks like. It's called Into the Crypt. It says the lights will show you the way. Collect all three artifacts and find the door. In order to be able to get this glove, you do need to get to Limbo. You need to get to Elude, and you need to get to the Null Void Zone, the Null. The only real glove you need is going to be reverse for this if you have friends. So this one is going to be for getting to Limbo. And then Rob and Bob are for going to the Null. So if you've never gotten like a uh, Tinker or the Null glove, then you probably don't even know what this is. <laughs> Elude, you don't need, but um, you are going to be heading to the Elude zone. I'm going to show you how to get that. You don't have to complete everything. So like, for example, the Null zone, you don't have to complete the whole like Tinker thing. There's nothing really crazy in it. It's just really getting into them and then finding the artifact. After you get all three artifacts, you do need to go and find the door and the door is located in the limbo so we're going to be doing the limbo last we're going to start with the null now like i said you don't have to have rob and bob to be able to open the portal for uh entering the null so um if you're if your friends have it great they can open it up for you or if maybe you go to a public server and they're already doing like rob and bob by the way there is a free ugc as part of this it's a snow peep i'll show what he looks like this is what the snow peep looks like he is a hat so i probably won't wear this but there's 50 thousand of these dude right here total quantity fifty thousand. we already have uh 800 people have gotten it or so um, a little bit more than 800 so th this is a pretty doable glove although there's thirty five thousand people online right now so you're gonna want to get cracking on this no 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 puns intended that's not a mislead you don't you need to use cracking okay starting with the c not not the k okay whatever so Let's uh, switch over to Rob. Zombie here has Bob. So you only need two people to do this at most. Although, you know, like I said, if you don't have the gloves, then it's going to be a little harder. So we're going to start with the easiest. So Zombie is going to spawn Bob shortly here. He's going to target me. He has to target me. Then I'm going to convert over to Rob. They're going to combine. I'm going to reset. And they're starting. Let me go and do that and get in. Now, um, you do have to switch to default glove. If you've never done this, you do need to switch to default. You can't be still uh, Rob or Bob gloves or else it won't work. All right, so now we're inside the knoll and we need to head towards the tinker. If you don't know what I'm talking about, don't worry about it. We got to kill these guys again. Ah, I got slapped. Yeah, you can slap each other in here. That's that's rude. So be careful if you're like with a troll, they could just slap you off into the void. Now we got to wait for the bridge. So activate the bridge right here. Hope that your friend's not going to knock you into the void. That would be so rude. Don't do that. Don't troll your friends. Yeah, just unequip that glove. Won't got any time. So you got to get through a couple waves of these minion guys. They're kind of annoying. Just slap them. Don't get too close to your teammate because you're going to slap them and then they're going to get like demolished. Ow. Nice. This one, uh, one of the teammates need to go down. So like have everyone stay up here because the floor is going to get covered. So you need to come through here. Just follow the end. And once you step on that little pressure plate, you want to get out before you get squished. So go up top, follow them. Just make sure you jump over this gap because the floor starts opening again and you don't want to fall back down. Almost nine out of 10 times people have fallen again. So once you're past these columns, just head over here. Make sure you use your ability to get across them and don't do it midair. Don't do that. Don't like jump and then do it. It's not bedwars. So you have to like boost first and then jump. And you got to clear these guys. So make sure you don't like take too many hits off these guys because you'll probably die. Also, don't uh, hit your teammate. So just get past these axes unless you don't press the pressure plate and are lucky but it pretty much turns on automatically because the minions step on them be careful not to hit your teammate into the axes <laughs> also uh just a tip you can see zombies over here he's bringing the minions you can bring them towards the axes and let the axes kill them see how the axes are actually knocking them down just make sure you like stay far away from each other so you don't slap each other into the axes but you can see it's doing a pretty good job just keep like one player on one side other player on the other side clear them as you need to yeah this is so much easier if you go in there you're pretty much dead you will die because there's so many of these try to use your boost when you can oh there's way more boost when you can oh dude he just almost sent me into an axe <laughs> um that's what i'm talking about don't slap here don't be careful all right so you need to go to the right don't go to the left side go to the right door in this room 
you just see a bunch of gel cells and then you're gonna head over here into this corner and there's the little ugc artifact collect that then reset you feel like something has diminished Wah. next we're gonna do elude now elude's gonna take us forever because it's like a 10 percent chance of it spawning so we kind of have to keep going to new arenas so in order to be able to complete the elude zone one you do need to find the keypad and it only spawns on one of two trees and it has a chance to spawn every 10 minutes like a 10 percent chance to spawn every 10 minutes on one of those trees so uh this is pain let me just say because you have to do it on public as well so you can't do it on private servers you have to do it on public servers so it's not just a matter of like sitting around on a private server waiting for a tree no dude and you might be wondering why i'm dressed up as cobblestone it's because people are harassing me in here they're hunting me down and slapping me so add a little difficulty to something that's already difficult but that's okay we will uh you know we will survive but here's the thing uh a keypad just spawned a little bit ago on the apple area so i did mention trees but i didn't tell you which trees so let me show you easiest thing to do is go to default only arena at the top here you can drop down to my island so come over here and there's a tree back here and this is how I did the loot the first time. There's a code that pops up here. So we're gonna go to Apple Island now on the opposite side of this. So we're gonna check for the keypad here. Now, again, this can only work on public servers. I'm only showing you on my VIP, so I stopped getting harassed, dude. I don't know why, but everyone likes slapping the star, you know? They like slapping the star curve. No! Hey, this works. <laughs> I thought I died. All right, so right behind this tree, it can also spawn. So those two trees you wanna check, and you probably either want to server hop or you can just camp out on the server and then once you have a keypad you're going to need to count the number of players on the server and then you can you know find a site like pocket tackets that has all the elude codes so based on the number of players it has like a little calculation or formula so if you have a full server it's going to be 1443 if you have like one slot left and such so those, that's the code you need to punch in so you got to be quick and uh, because most players already have this up <laughs> they already have it even probably memorized that's how crazy it is and uh Good luck to me. I got to go find a server now. So this is what happens, by the way. So this is the key code. You're looking for this. You do need to enter the codes. Um, after you enter the code, you got to hit the green button. And then if you get it right, then you got it. Got it. All right. So we're going to the elude zone. It's in here. So just go behind the map. So look at the map. And then you're going to go around here. And it's going to be in the corner. All right. That's it. All right, so the next one, you just need reverse. So we need to go to Limbo. So zombie's gonna come in here. Um, don't worry about my avatar. I was, uh, this is my disguise. This is my disguise. So for this one, what you need to do is another player has to have reverse equipped and you just reverse each other. So you're gonna slap each other with both of you set as reverse and then you're gonna go and get knocked out. So there's a chance that it's gonna teleport you. Um, it's kind of, it's probably gonna take us about 10 to 15 times. Usually it could take more, but for the most part, it usually doesn't take that long. I used to get it in like one in five. There we go, we got it. All right, so blinding light, we are going to limbo. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna head left. So facing this guy, or actually if you're facing the void, go to the right so you can see zombies chat here. He says, follow. You're gonna jump up here on this pillar go up don't mix don't miss your jump to the point where you fall in the void or else you're gonna rage so don't fall in the void all right coming up here and you can see it right here can't can't miss it and then after this uh make sure you don't like exit so now you got to go to a door so go into this thing it's a crystal and go in the white door. Now we're still, we just got sent to the null zone and the relic calls for your audience. So come up here and he's like a little cute little guy. He's a snow peep, dude. Look how awesome he is. That's so cool. So we're gonna just click on him to claim him. Don't forget to do that or else you can't claim it. And we got the badge, dude. This was probably the worst update that Slap Battles has ever done though. <laughs> I'm telling you, dude. Okay, I'm just ragey, okay? I've been spending so much time. I don't like updates that make you uh, kind of hate other people, you know? And that, that's a strong word. But when you start getting really mad at people because you see the, just the greed and you're in it, you're one of those people. Yeah, it's, it's tough. Now, granted, I would have been patient. I would have waited until tonight to uh, get this glove but i have to make a video for you uh now we got pan so let's go show pan there's also another glove in here by the way um not just pan but there's one called blasphemy this one's a lot easier you just 
kind of it's like a chance of getting it based on getting hit by a glove i think it's like a three percent chance um based on getting hit by bus so just keep getting hit by bus and i don't know if it works on vip servers it probably does seems like a pretty easy glove to get three percent i mean get hit like 33 times <laughs> all right here is the pan glove i hit him there we go i just saw tinsel hit hit the guy <laughs> all right let, let's uh let's hit this guy he gets hit twice. So you can also uh, change the direction. So you can say right. <laughs> Tinsel just keeps smacking him. So it's red. Let's hit this guy. Yeah, left. Left, Tinsel. <laughs> so you can tell him which way to go. So if you want him to hit him on the right side or the left side, just hit E. So like this guy, I want him to hit him to the right side. So he's going to hit him to the right. Oh, I missed it. This guy right here to the right. All right, Tinsel. Dude. All right, let's go here. I want him to go left. <laughs> Dude, he has a little cloud. He has a little cloud. That's so great. Yeah, hit him. Get him, Tinsel. All right, to the right, to the right. <laughs> oh, he landed him up there. Oh, no, I got him all mad at me. I got him all mad at me. I got him all mad at me. <laughs> Did he turn him gold? I think he turned him gold. I didn't realize he turns him gold. Yeah, he, Tensil can make him gold. I keep hearing the sound when he does it. <laughs> Dude. Oh, he got sent. He got sent. He's so competitive. Anyway, I'm going to go get the Blasphemy Glove now. Like I said, just get hit by a bus over and over. I'm going to try it on VIP server first and see if we can get it. Good luck on this grind. I know I feel your pain on Elude. Look, it took me like an hour and a half to get this. It took forever, man. And let's just say i was very angry i gave up a couple times on this video because i was so mad most games don't make me mad man this was a uh, frustrating update just think about like you know I, I i like updates that are more collaborative or maybe just make it so that it would have been doable on private server then people wouldn't be you know as upset but probably would have been too easy i think the main issue is with the keypad you can delete it you can also interrupt people you know people are like hoarding it they're blocking it with mega rock they're using spectator there's so many issues with this and Spectator and Mega Rock alone are kind of causing chaos with this. I would say remove the elude thing and maybe use like the other, remember the obby? They should have just used the retro zone. That would have been way better than elude because then at least, you know, you have a chance. Make it a little harder, but not that hard. Yeah, elude, worst part of the update. Everything else was awesome. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Good luck on your grind and get that UGC. There's still so many of them available. This is going to be pretty easy for you as long as you can get it. Don't stress. Till next time, happy grinding. Also, shout out to Zombie for the huge help he uh he kind of helped a lot with this so all credit goes to the zombie peace wait 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 someone use reverse on me i want to use it dude you get sent i got sent and goldened by tensile that's hilarious that was on the reverse you